Size Coral Trout. Welcome back to IETV. So in this episode, it's going to cover our two-day jigging and casting trip in Pekan, Malaysia with uh, Captain Ricky. Day one was a ton of fun. I managed to catch my personal best coral trout using an artificial jig. Day two, things slowed down quite a bit, but uh, you know, some trips are like that. But regardless, let's go ahead and take a look at day number one. All right, stand to go to the first spot, guys. See you there. Okay. I got my camera, don't worry. Ah, uh, you are? Oh, uncle! Get the net, my brother! Get the net, my brother! Nice! Oh, yes, man! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> nice, bro! <laughs> okay. Oh, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Poga, poga! <laughs> that was pretty quick. Is that your biggest cow? Yeah. This is worth 100 fish. <laughs> Okay guys, check it out. It's a good size coral trout on the Major Craft Jig Parana Semi Long 60 gram in the chrome color. So we're jigging for Tengiri, but uh, this guy decided to take my jig instead. <laughs> really happy with that. Okay, now let's try and catch another one, huh? <laughs> nice. Got it, got it. Menjang tu dekat depan. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Nah, man. Wow, big copia, man. Big copia. Twenty kilo. Big copia, big copia. Twenty. 
Guys in the front too. Put my jig over the board. Walk to the front. Alright. Don't want to fall. Alright, I'll put you guys right here. I think you gotta put it in uh, my ice box. I think. Okay, dia dia pecah juga pagar. Pecah juga pagar. Try and find a coral trout. Yeah. All right, and that's gonna bring us to the end of the episode. So that fish right there was actually my last fish of the trip because on day two I caught absolutely nothing. Caught zero fish. Uh, pretty much it was like an ice cream in the hot sun melting away. And uh, yeah, but overall it was a really good trip. I did manage to catch my personal best coral trout, which is fantastic. It came in at I think about seven pounds. Um, and uh, yeah, it's sitting in my freezer now. I'm really gonna enjoy eating that one in the next couple of days. 
So this trip was actually um, on April 1st and April 2nd. So last year's Pecan trip where I posted uh, two videos, it was around the same time with the same captain. And uh, in my opinion, that was a lot better. But the only reason why I'm saying that is because we caught a lot more Tangiris and uh, a lot more Trevellis, which, you know, the fight is a lot longer. So I can, you know, I have time to get my camera and to record. But this trip, we actually caught a ton of coral trouts. Uh, let me check just how many we caught. Hang on. All right, so I just counted the amount of coral trouts we caught. So it's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So it's in total, we caught 12 coral trouts uh, across two days and uh, six packs on board. So that's really good. Uh, we did catch some parrot fish on day number two also. Um, but again, I caught zero fish on day two. So it's the other guys that caught the uh, parrot fish, the queen fish, and of course, a lot of the uh, 30 to 40 cm groupers, which were, you know, a lot of fun. They caught them on micro jigs, um, but I stuck to using the major craft jig para semi long. So it's a long profile jig trying to catch like a big one, which I did on day one, but sadly I didn't find any big ones on day two as much as I would have liked to, but uh, you know, it is what it is. All right, but anyway, if you guys are wondering what tackle I used, all of that information will be in the description box down below. And uh, as always, if you like this video, do give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.